What is up you guys, it's Rob here. In this plus 500 review, I'm going to answer all your questions regarding this website. Is plus 500 reliable? Is it a scam or legit? How does it work? And all this kind of stuff. I used this website for the first time in 2016, but I don't use it anymore. And I'm going to reveal you the reasons why, and I'm going to show you exactly what this website is all about. Before we dive into all the details, remember to smash up the likes for this video if you like to make money online and also subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell so you will never miss out any new video because I'm uploading all the time new videos and helping people to make a life-changing income online. But now let's dive into our PLUS500 review. So first of all, what is PLUS500? It's a trading platform where you can buy different trading instruments for ETFs, shares, commodities, even cryptocurrencies for many different things. And it's a very fast growing company. When I took a look at their financial reports, they showed that they have been growing fast every single year. And in 2018, their yearly sales revenue was more than 700 million dollars. That means that it's a very well established company and it was already founded back in 2008. Then in five years it grew into more than 100 million dollars per year and then from 2013 until 2018 they grew from 100 million to more than 800 million dollars per year. So it's a huge company that provides services for people all around the world. So how does it work? How can you get started on Plus 500? Basically the process works like this. You sign up with your email address, then you need to do the verification. So basically show your passport or, or your location or these kind of things. The basic process that is always with all kinds of trading or investing platforms. And once you get approved, you can start trading. And then what can you trade on Plus500 and can you invest on that platform? That was the question that I asked recently with them. I had done some trading in 2016, but I again asked it now in 2019, what can you trade there? And I want to highlight and underline that you only can trade their instruments, their trading instruments like CFDs and these kind of things. It means that you cannot buy shares directly, for example, through their website. So you cannot do long-term investing. That's something very important that you need to keep in mind that if you sign up with them and you start on their platform, you can only do this short-term trading, which is very fast-paced thing. And people, of course, ask, is Plus500 reliable? Is Plus500 a scam or legit? Can I start trading there? Like, is it like, will my money be safe if I start trading there? And all kinds of things. So yes, it is reliable. It has been around for more than 10 years. Uh, the trading volume is huge. Millions of people have probably been trading there. So it's reliable. They also have very responsive support. They have 24 seven live support. I tried it myself and it works great. They replied pretty quickly and they were very helpful. I was actually surprised because I have also tried many similar platforms like this one and usually the chat support is not so good but on Plus500 I must admit that I was positively surprised by their support. And I think that's also very important because if support is bad and something happens with your account or something then it's, it's not too nice. For example, some years ago when I was uh, trading or investing in cryptocurrencies and I couldn't contact the support. I got an answer like one month after that that you don't want that to happen. You want to invest in the platforms and trade on platforms where the support is fast and reliable because then you know that your money will be safe. So I can give points for plus 500 for that. But now the question, why did I stop trading? Why I don't trade on this platform? Let me tell you the reason. So first of all, I would like to define myself as a long-term investor. I don't know if you are short-term trader or long-term investor, but I am personally a long-term investor. The reason for that is that most people who do trading, they lose money. Like 
Experts and studies show that more than 90%, 9 out of 10 people who do short-term trading, they lose money and only around 1 out of 10 win money. So if you take 10 people, only one of them will make money and 9 of them will lose money. I have several friends who have started trading and basically almost all of them have lost money because they don't bother to study and learn. With long-term investing on the other hand, most investors make money in the stock market because it's pretty easy. Like it's much much easier to make money with long-term investing than with short-term trading. Of course, you can learn the skills to make money with trading. Of course, that is learnable and I could also learn those skills. And I know that I could be wonderful at trading because I'm a strong chess player, I know how to calculate things, I'm very good at mathematics and numbers, so I know these things, I could be trading, but the reason why I'm not doing it is that I feel that I don't provide so much value to people when I do the trading, I, I feel that I can provide much more value when I uh, create educational videos or blog posts or emails where I help people to make money online, and that's my passion, that's my desire, my desire is to help ordinary people to make a life changing income online and achieve their true potential. And if I would be trading all day long, I couldn't be creating videos or blog posts or emails or any content. So that's why I don't do it. I feel like it's not aligned with my own mission, but of course it may be different for you. Like if you love trading, if you love numbers, if you feel that there, there is some value, you are providing value for the marketplace, go ahead and do it if you feel that's for you. I'm not saying that if I'm not doing, other people couldn't do it. You can go ahead and do it. I will leave you a link for plus 500 in the description if you want to get started with them. So if you are looking for a reliable trading platform, plus 500 is a way to go. But I want to say a word of warning before you sign up, because personally I know several people who have lost lots of money in trading so I don't want that you would lose any money with trading so before you get started and spend lots of money on that learn the skills get some books from Amazon get some bestsellers about trading uh, some let's say best books that can teach you step by step how you can do the trading on watch videos on YouTube even buy step by step courses if you want and invest your, in your own learning first before you do any trades because then when you start trading, then you can really make money and you don't need to lose money. And that's very important that first you learn the skills and you don't just go there. Because if you don't have any experience or much knowledge and you start doing it, most likely 99.9% that's a probability is that you will lose money. So please study the skills first and learn the skills so you will make money instead of losing money. And that's what I also did when I started investing. Like I said, I'm an investor. So instead of right away going to the stock market and buying all kinds of things, I took several books from one of the best books from some of the best investors. I studied the skills, I learned what should I do, what should I avoid and all these kind of things and then I started and I started small, I didn't put in everything right away, I started small so that's what I also recommend to you, start small because then you will also learn by doing and then you can make the mistakes with small money and once you start putting in more money then you can be much more profitable. So those are my recommendations for you and if you have done the research, if you have done uh, learning then you can cl click the link in the description and get started sign up start trading and making money and now if you ask me are there better ways to make money online than trading and I would say yes affiliate marketing is what I recommend especially if you don't have much capital because you can start it basically for free and then once you start earning you can invest more and more money so I will leave you a link in the description always in my videos I leave uh, my number one recommendation to make a full-time income online in the description and how I treat these things is that affiliate marketing and internet marketing is my main income source and then the extra that I have I invest it in somewhere but if you are interested in investing and this kind of things I would say that the earning potential is probably much higher if you do internet marketing and all these kind of things so I will leave you a link in the description where you can get started 
with my personal step-by-step -step guidance you will be able to ask me any questions so that is my number one recommended way to make money online but feel free to subscribe to my youtube channel if you want to get more make money online videos smash up likes for this video if you found it valuable and helpful and feel free to share it with all of your friends and followers thank you very much for watching until next time